Understanding the times to come, exploring future tenses in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to delve into a fascinating phrase that often pops up in English, the times to come. This phrase is not only poetic but also deeply embedded in the way we talk about the future. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of what it means and how to use it effectively in your conversations. Let's get started. The times to come is a phrase that refers to the future. It's a way to talk about events, situations, or periods that have not yet happened. This phrase often carries a sense of anticipation or uncertainty, as the future is always unknown. It can be used in various contexts, whether discussing future trends, personal plans, or hypothetical scenarios. To better understand the times to come, let's look at some examples. 1. We are preparing for the times to come with optimism and new strategies. 2. The novel explores life in the times to come, painting a vivid picture of the future. 3. In the times to come, technology will play an even more significant role in our lives. In these examples, the phrase is used to talk about future events or situations, emphasizing a forward-looking perspective. There are several other ways to express the concept of the times to come in English. Some synonyms and variations include the future, days ahead, what lies ahead, coming times, future times. Each of these can be used interchangeably, depending on the context and the tone you want to convey. When using the times to come, remember that it's a formal and somewhat poetic phrase. It's perfect for written English, speeches, or formal discussions. In everyday conversation, simpler phrases like the future or what lies ahead might be more appropriate. We hope this video has shed light on the intriguing phrase, the times to come, and how it relates to discussing the future in English. Remember, exploring such phrases enriches your language skills and helps you express yourself more eloquently. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to exploring more exciting aspects of the English language with you in the times to come.